Hey, everybody, if you watch our show, you know we like to talk a lot about RV Share. Uh, but for those of you who are new and might not know what RV Share is, don't worry. We've got you covered. Maddie Bougere is here with us. Uh, Maddie, uh, for folks who don't know, tell us a little bit about uh, RV Share and just what you guys do and, and uh, how much fun it is. Yeah, thanks for having me, Chris. Um, RV Share is the largest RV rental marketplace in the US. We have more than 100,000 RVs that travelers can rent to go on a road trip or a camping trip right from people who own RVs in their local area. If you're a first timer, uh, you know, somebody like me who I've been in RVs before, but if I'm ever planning a trip, my first thought goes to, hey, I should probably book a hotel. Why is it better to uh, go with an RV and, and rent an RV out? Yeah, that's a great question. I mean, personally, I think that there's a right accommodation for every type of trip. And if you're looking to go camping, get out there in nature, visit a national park, a hotel's not the best way to do it. It's actually an RV. It's a super unique experience that is fun for the whole family. Your kids will love to explore these types of RVs that have bunk beds and really cool amenities like sound systems, a TV, even sometimes like an outdoor kitchen where you can grill and have a cool campfire. So it's just a really unique way to get together and you know experience nature well and i know we've talked about it in past segments too but if you're somebody sitting at home going hey you know i have an rv sitting in the driveway that i haven't used in six months this is also a good way to potentially make a little extra cash yeah, that's right. And there are so many RVs that people just don't use as much as they thought they would. And the best what thing to do with that is to rent it out on RV share, because then you get to ex share your ex RV with other people so that they can try it out and have an amazing experience as well. Well, what are some uh, kind of first time tips uh, for, for folks who are dipping their toes into the RV uh, uh, rental market? Yeah. So my first tip, and it's a great one because a lot of people just don't realize it's an option is to get the RV delivered. So you can have the RV delivered directly to your campground. They'll set it up and pretty much just eliminate all the things that might, you might be fearful of, like driving the RV, dumping the RV after you've stayed for the weekend. So making sure that the owner is there for you, everything's set up. All you have to do is show up and enjoy. And then my second tip is that the owner is your best resource. So whenever booking, you'll want to use your the owner to ask questions and they really know everything about their rig. So always go to them when you have any outstanding questions. And then my third tip is, you know, don't overdo it. Make sure you plan a trip that's super easy for the first time. You don't want to do a 10 stop road trip or a camping trip that's maybe 10 days. Just go down the street find your local state park, you know, and, and have that RV delivered so you can experience RV travel for the first time. And then the best tip of all is invite friends along. Multiple people could join you. You could have multiple RVs delivered. And it's a really cool way to just get together with friends and have a fun camping weekend. That sounds great. And, and heck, I'm thinking too, you know, we're, we're still in summer, but football season's right around the corner. This yeah. might not be a bad idea uh, if you so rent over a tailgate. Yeah, that's a great idea. Definitely people do that. They don't only rent it for camping and road trips, tailgating, music festivals. There's a ton of different ways you can use RVs to have an amazing experience. I'm one of those people when I'm on vacation, I like a spot where I can go and quickly take a nap. And I know you can do that in, in these RVs. So it, it sounds exactly. like a win-win. It is, it is. Yeah, <laughs> where can people uh, get more information? Yeah, please come check us out at rvshare.com. Maddie, thank you so much. Thanks, Chris.